Hello, tennis enthusiasts. Welcome back to Grip News 2M, your go-to source for the latest in the world of tennis. In a round of 16 showdown, Czech teenager Linda Noskova faced off against number 19 seed Alina Svitolina of Ukraine. The match took an unexpected turn when Svitolina, facing a 2-0 deficit in the opening set, called for a medical timeout. The trainer attended to her back, and unfortunately for Svitolina, she couldn't continue. Svitolina conceded a 3-0 lead to Noskova, leading to her retirement from the match. Svitolina shared her disappointment with reporters, explaining, I got a spasm, or I don't know exactly what it is, but like shooting pain in the first game, the last two points. Yeah, couldn't do anything. Completely locked my back. Just very sad, of course. This marks Noskova's first Grand Slam quarterfinal, and it comes on the heels of her impressive victory against world number one Iga Shiantek in the previous round. The 19-year-old Czech player is certainly making waves in Melbourne. Noskova is now set to face Ukrainian qualifier Diana Yastremska in the quarterfinals. In a post-match statement, Noskova expressed her thoughts on the upcoming challenge, saying, I think she's playing really great. She came through qualies and had some great matches here. We've never played each other. I don't really know the way she plays, but I think she's more of, like, an aggressive tennis player. She continued, so I guess we won't have a lot of rallies, but I think that I will just have to be prepared for anything because I don't really know her style. We'll see what happens. It's clear that Noskova is approaching the next match with a mix of confidence and caution, acknowledging the unpredictability of facing a qualifier with a unique playing style. Tennis fans are eagerly anticipating this clash between two talented players. That's it for now on Noskova's journey at the Australian Open. Stay tuned for more updates, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to stay in the loop with Grip News 2M.